this is an RS Norlatch. What we use them for is to power things like doors. Or uh, minecart track switches. Those sorts of things. Uh, here are a few different varieties of them. There are uh, probably about 20, uh, 20 or so varieties that are in similar size here. So there's no whoops, wrong side. There's no shortage of uh, types. That's for sure. They even have uh, ones that are only one block wide for uh, stackability. So, uh, how do you work, build these things? Well, they're very easy to build. Uh, basically, all an RS NAR latch is is two torches trying to turn each other off. If you have two torches anywhere and they're both hooked up to each other in a way that will power uh, the other one, grab some dust here. That mod is too many items because everybody's going to ask. All right, so. Um, that's an RS Norlatch. This torch is trying to turn off this torch, if it was powered, and this torch is turning off this torch. If you input a signal to one side or the other, I'll use a button for illustration, this button will turn off this torch, which will allow the other torch to come on, which in turn will keep this torch from coming back on. If we go back and look at these other uh, varieties for a second, uh, you can see that uh, they're all doing the same thing. This torch here is powering the repeater, which is powering the block, which is powering the dust, which is powering this block, which is keeping this torch off. And uh, if this torch was to come on, like so, uh, like so, by turning that torch off, say, let me say that differently. Uh, if this torch was to be turned off, this torch would be allowed to come on, which would power this dust, which would keep that torch off. So this torch is powering that torch, and this torch is powering that torch. And the same thing here. You got this port torch powering that one, and that one powering that one. And same thing again, powering this torch, which is trying to power that torch. They're all basically the same, just different shapes. So don't let the shapes confuse you. Just look at the uh, what's really happening to them. So you could call this side the set. And you could call this side the reset. Because it'll send it back to its original state. You could also call this side the set. And call this side the reset. My point is, it doesn't matter. It could be uh, in any way. If, if there's something coming in, to turn off a torch, call that side the set. If it's sending it back to its default or original state, then you'd call that the reset. It doesn't matter where it is, if it's uh, powered or unpowered, it doesn't. Well, it has to be unpowered to start and then powered. But. And uh, so if those are the set and reset. The output <coughs> can be anywhere you want as well. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, if you, uh, you can put a door over here. Well, that's not a door. That's a wooden push plate. There we go. Put the door over there. It'll open it. You could also uh, throw a few more doors in here. Uh, you could also put a door off of... Uh, take that away for a second. You can do it off of the torch itself. And it's not going to turn. It. The redstone goes straight into the door, and uh, it will work directly off the torch as well. It will also work off the powered side. You could run a uh, line to a door powered, and it would open and close it, like so. So it doesn't really matter where you put your outputs. You could even... Uh, you could run it off the side here like that. That could be used as an output you know, over this way. And basically what an RS Norlatch does is it stores information. And uh, typically that information is something like uh, somebody stepped on a pressure plate or somebody pushed a button.
that kind of thing. So if you have this RS more latch here and you have a pressure plate, um, pressure plate. Uh, if you step on it, the RSNR latch will remember that you stepped on that plate. So that's the basics of an RSNR latch. Um, they're actually very simple if you understand the basic fact that all it is is one torch trying to turn off the other torch. That's all it is. So anytime you have that situation, uh, you have an RSNR latch. And you can use it however you want, depending on whatever uh, requirements you have at the time. The shape, the size has no f effect on the function as long as one torch is turning the other one off, and vice versa. Thanks for watching.